All right, everyone, it's back again. Got leaves falling on this guy's truck. And we're out trash picking for another day. They have a scrap pile in the back. It's fine that they didn't come over here and just grab this. It's our day of treasure hunting with taco stacks. I know I don't have my chest mount on right now. I have my jacket on, which chest mount can't go over the jacket, but I'll put you down here in a second and grab the rest of this. I don't tear up my rubber in my my van. It's cool over there. But yeah, it's trash day with taco stacks. We're gonna to try to find some treasure out here, things we can recycle. Uh well, I can probably get this last one. Things we can reuse, recycle in terms of scrap. And uh who knows what else we'll find. I'll grab that one with two hands. Can't carry this and that with two hands, so I figured I might as well just take you along for one more trip. Hopefully by the afternoon shift, I'll have uh, less clothes on. Not a t-shirt, but not a huge jacket. Cold morning, let's find some treasure out here. Trash picking, let's do it. All right, kind of second clip here. Um, I did have a lot of comments on my recent uh, storage unit video, uh, people saying that I never actually go ahead and show you guys the rest of this stuff or the stuff that I picked through uh, and separate from the trash out of those storage units. Do I take everything just strictly to the dump? Am I a fraud? And uh, unfortunately, I am not a fraud. Um, this is literally the pile of stuff to still kind of go through. I did go through maybe a half or two thirds. That is not this stuff. Um, out of those storage unit videos, but I know I always promised I would show you guys in future videos what I find if I find anything. And realistically, I have not found much. There is so much paperwork, uh, lots of canned food. Um, I did find a bunch of coins. This is all a donation pile over here, but you guys might remember that really broken jar of pennies. I put it into a nice larger jar that is not broken and it's plastic. But, and other than that, I did get a bag of trash bags. I got Vice City, a manual for, I think this is PlayStation 2, a couple Wii games, or a Wii game. And this is a PlayStation game. I thought there was a Dreamcast game also. There is an NBA 2K, a Dreamcast game. So uh, not trash picking, but I did want to do kind of an update on the storage unit video. Uh, also, I thought these were Sachidawoya, definitely pronounced that wrong, uh, coins. Uh, there were two in there, but the rest of these are actually from Chuck E. Cheese's. So, yep, not a fraud. I still go through everything from those storage unit videos. They don't go straight to the dump. Uh, time just an update. And uh, yeah, let's head out for the second half of this video. I got a sweatshirt on as well. It kind of warmed up. But yeah, update on the storage unit video. Probably the last one, if not the one before. Yep. All right, now I have the heat cranked up so much that it's, it's kind of cooking me. It's always a weird intersection also up there. You would think this road stops because there's a very busy side street. There's actually no stop sign. Anyway, I'm over here because I'm going to pick up yet another I might go from this way. Don't want to crunch all those leaves. Are they broken? Don't need the suitcases. I don't know what they are. Well, I know what they are. I just don't know why on the circle thing. <laughs> on the circle thing. On the corner it has this like circle thing. I would think that's for water drainage, but I might not be right. Is water drainage the correct term then? Because you think about it, it'd be drainage for water. So would you really say water drainage? Or would it just be drainage that drains water? I'm not sure. I don't know why I'm like so attracted to picking up those planters. I now have a very large collection. What is this scratch? That's going away. Nice thing about a white vehicle, scratches on it don't appear like on a black vehicle or on darker color, such as blue. 
Um, I always thought about getting the dark gray, dark gray van. I thought they looked really sleek, uh, but man, they'd get scratched up like no other. find a lot of small crates. I just thought about that. This is pretty small. This is, I don't know, maybe uh, two feet or so. Yeah, probably about two feet. It's fairly small. It's very, it's, I wouldn't say it's very light, but... Ow. It's ran right into my mirror. I usually find medium or really large crates. That couch looks very heavy. Very heavy. It's the first couch I've seen today. I guess people don't throw away couches in the fall and winter. I don't know why I consider this winter. I don't have said that a couple times. It feels cold out in the morning, but it's not winter. Not yet, thankfully. As much as I love these boxes, they never sell. However, I think this might be even military related. Um maybe not. Oh my goodness, the whole thing just runs off. Trunk, oh my God. I can't. The amount of mold on that is just insane. I can't even breathe around it. <coughs> I hope I didn't bring too much of it in. I mean, it's cool. I would definitely get it if it wasn't. But I did not even second guess myself with that one. It's cool, but. I value my health a little bit more. I don't know who would buy it either with that mold, but it's cool. I just, I can't do it. If I get burned, if you're on mold that burns, that was it. It's that time of the year now. This is a house that's for sale for quite some time. It's a mowed lawn. Like that whole area is just mowed, like freshly mowed. And then you have this out here. Give it a month, I'm not going to give them a second thought. But you have a freshly mowed lawn, and that is at the curb with no sign that says scrap free nothing. It's either lack of social awareness that you left your mower there, or I don't know. Only a courtesy would get rid of that, but I think any honest person would just leave it. Wow, this is bringing back memories. My good friend Mark, who moved kind of far away pretty sure this was the house he told me about. He had an amazing... He had an amazing... That's brass. Copper score here a while back. whole barrel was filled of copper tubing. I'm pretty sure it was this house. I hate frogs, but I think this is a good one. Shuttle, I think, for knitting. Might be wrong with that. Basket might be something. Chocolate milk, no, don't need milk. No. It's kind of a cool basket, also. Alrighty. this 
something. I don't know about that rug. Not expert in rugs. Just throw these in here. I don't know if I have enough metal for the metal drawer, but maybe. That's gonna take a walk. I have to go two pieces at a time. We got time now. Not sure what this is. Usually this is usually it'd be a trampoline. fiberglass. Don't want to snap that in half. I did that accidentally. I tried snapping uh, fiberglass markers. Like driveway markers. So I can fit in my trash can easier. Excruciating pain. Trying to get that fiberglass out of your hands. I mean that's in a ball game of its own. Not as bad as yellow jacket stings but they hurt. Alright, should be the last stop of the day. I'll probably see it again in the next clip, but it is warmed up. It is definitely warmed up. It was not this warm five hours ago. Oh, this thing's heavy. Now I guess I do have enough metal now. It's actually in pretty decent shape. I would insert a warehouse joke here, but it's been over said a million times, so I won't say it. So that one stop, man, we got some nice antiques there. Um, I should probably take out this. Uh... So this is like another thing with my videos I've noticed. Like right now, it kind of looks like that's all dark and that's light because of the sun. Uh, with my storage unit videos, people have also said that they like if the camera was just like stationary. But I think if I do it stationary... You don't really see anything over there, um, and I have to haul out every single item for you to see it, um, which might be a little bit different. I, I think there's a lot more that goes into it other than just point-and-shoot videography of YouTube. Um, you see how like now the camera kind of registers the light and can kind of focus on these items. That's when I, I don't think uh, keeping it stationary with sunlight like that would be very possible. So I think I said this was for knitting. Um, I believe this is for yeah. Weaving, maybe, might be the right word. It's, uh, it's, I believe it's called a shuttle. It's a wooden shuttle. Go on to those days. Um, smells like an old... Smells like an old attic. That looks like just... Ooh, whoa. No. Well, that was nice. There's another one of those. This is 1897. Looks like. Yep. That's a shame. Yeah, you can tape it together. It's an old photo. That is amazing. I don't know what it is of. Man, I like to. See what other kind of stuff this guy's gonna throw out in the future. Because this stuff is all old stuff. Like, it's not like this. That might be. I don't know. It's kind of cool though. It's a, I think it's an elephant. This looks fairly old. Fairly old. Point out lightly. Some other oddies. I thought these baskets were awesome. I usually don't take baskets, but anything that's kind of like odd shaped like this and in really, really good shape, 
I will definitely try to grab. I gravitate toward that, towards that stuff. I thought that basket was a little odd shaped as well. So that's why I grabbed that. That is brass, which once I take out all that stuff, I can probably scrap that. We got to take out this. I did have some metal. I will show you guys this because I'm going to let this air dry. Maybe is the right word. I'm going to probably take this to the... Uh, I'll probably do that. I'll take it to the uh, the car wash. Oh, you know what? I have my own pressure washer. I didn't think of that. Then I got to haul it. Hmm. We'll think about that. But I'm going to take this out for the time being. Does anyone know anything about it other than that it's a rug? And it's red. It has little tassel things on it. I see some wear and tear right there. Some people like to cut this stuff up. I don't want to sell this rug for... I'm going to Lamberville in a couple days. I do want to... Ooh, that's in bad shape up there. Ooh, that's a really rough shape. That just... Probably shouldn't be doing that, but... It's probably better if I get rid of that rather than keep it on there. Seen some days. Yeah, it's all torn up. People like to cut them up. That's what they like to do. If not, I'll go back out in the trash. Not like I have enough trash as it is. Well, we'll see if it sells. We'll see if it sells. It does need a good washing, though. But other than that, it's been an awesome day of trash picking. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this wonderful treasure hunt with me. It's been a blast. If you guys enjoyed this video, definitely smack the like button. Subscribe down below. I know recently I checked out my views, and a lot of, uh, a lot of the views on the channel are from subscribers. So uh, if you... If you ever so kindly would want to, definitely subscribe down below. It definitely helps out the channel. And I'll catch you guys next time for our next adventure. Who knows what we'll get into. It'll be something fun. Till next time, have a great day. Keep living the dream. Peace.